morning, everyone. Good morning. Good to see you here. We've got a lot of visitors this morning. Uh, no, you're not. <laughs> no, you don't come into that category. Okay. You know, the third time it's in. Yeah, yeah. I didn't even really count you that much last week. Oh, okay. But uh, we have a great group over here to the right. Uh, and uh, I was just talking with a young man here that I think sort of the spokesman for the group. Uh, am I correct? It's your sort of, your sort of the spokesman for the group. Would you would you uh, just tell us a little bit about you guys that you were just telling me? Uh, uh, my name is Larry. I'm an alcoholic addict, um, and I'm the vice president of the MC. Um, what we do is we raise money for the Hayes House kids every year. Um, to make sure that those kids feel loved. We take them out on rides every now and then, take them to dinner or ice cream, things like that. And just kind of support the community and the recovery community a lot. Yeah. Yeah. Well, yes. I was really glad to have you guys here. And I've already apologized to them about the children's thing. Uh, they're going to stay today, but uh, they understand our position about that and they respect that that you know we're offering that for people and you know uh they may be able to work out something else uh and come back and be with us again sometime and uh we would love to do that and he's going to get me information about uh their rides and their activities and, and those things i think it would be a really good thing for us to try to hook into that and help support you guys whenever we can and uh we really appreciate what you do Okay. Awesome. awesome. They can always come back for Ride to Drive Sundays, right? Yes, I, I gave them. I gave them. <laughs> <laughs> I the list on that and everything. So, yeah, just know that you're fully, fully open, welcome here anytime, all the time. Just happy to have you here. Okay? Yeah, and good to see you guys back. You may can't be counting this district. <laughs> <laughs> and Justin, good to see Justin in back with us this morning, too. Okay, let me. Uh, let me begin by sharing just a few announcements and then we'll get into our praise and worship. Uh, uh, April the 1st, ICMS is having their spring fun run and registration will be from 1030 to noon at Story Park here in Meridian. Then you'll get the ride schedule, you can make the events and then it'll close out with a, a potato bar from 4 to 6 in Nampa at the Legion Hall. That's at 1504 2nd Avenue in Nampa. So uh, we want to be uh, a part of that. Uh, Sunday, April the 9th is uh, Resurrection Sunday and uh, we will be having Lord's Supper. I know most of you like to know when we're having that so you can uh, not miss. Uh, Saturday, May the 6th is ICMS Awareness Rally. That's uh, up at Lucky Peak and uh, hopefully uh, we can join together at that. Uh, it's from 10 to 1 uh, gathering, and then the ride goes down, starts at 1 o'clock, and goes down to the Capitol. All of you are familiar with that. And uh, Soul Zone is going to be operating the gate, so any of you that would like to join with us and uh, help at the gate, then uh, uh, Steve and Deb uh, can get us hooked in at a time for that. Uh, to sort of help them out with that. Now, uh, 12 o'clock Sunday, May the 14th, is our first ride and drive. So we want you to start mm -hmm. getting that in mind and on your on your schedule and all. And uh, it's going to be here before you know it. But uh, that's our first ride and drive. The Bible study this week will be canceled. Um, uh, I think Doug is what out of town. Surgery. He's having surgery. Injection. Okay. I, okay. I, 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 yeah. Okay. Yeah. I knew he was having injections. I, I didn't know that he was going to have surgery. But anyway, he's not having surgery. That's good. Okay. The sewing group will meet Thursday at one o'clock here. Also. Now, keep in mind the Stanton baby bottle drive. That's going to be the last Sunday of April. So we'll get our baby bottles. We'll have a period of time that we can 
collect the money and uh, then we can turn that in. Mike has already got a good thing going back there with the big bowl. If you have some change anytime, drop it in there and then that will transfer over uh, to the bottles or either just give it to them in, in the, you know, a lump of it. And we do take checks and bills back Yes, there. yes. <laughs> well, anybody's interested, the Vintage Bike Show is in Caldwell, the 18th and 19th of March also coming up. Okay, I didn't have that on my schedule. 18th and 19th of March. <coughs> Everything starts going in March, doesn't it? Yeah. March into the year, you know. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> Got any antique bikes you want to put in or get a hold of me? I'll tell you how. What if they're not running? <laughs> <laughs> All mine, but they're all choppers and stuff. 18th and 19th. 18th and 19th is the Vintage Bike Show. Yeah. Yeah. Uh, the ride. The ride out the yeah. park where we call up and away. And the show, the 19th. 19th show. Okay. Thank you for letting me know that. I'll get a, I'll get a flyers put up. Okay. That would be great. And uh, in order, in saying that, uh, I would really like you guys to help me this year. Uh, if you have any knowledge of any rides that are coming up, would you let me know? Uh, because there, <laughs> yeah, there's sure. a lot, yeah. Uh, but, you know, so that I can try to put some, announce some of them and maybe we can make plans to try to gather some of them. And then also with the car shows, uh, we like to go to car shows too. So. If you, you know, if you uh, know some dates on those things, I would appreciate you get it to me because I have a tendency to, you know, not know when something's happened and, and then, the, you know, yeah. next Sunday everybody's saying, wow, that's a great car show. Well, why didn't you tell me about it? You know, <laughs> I didn't even know. But uh, we appreciate that. Okay, <clears throat> now, I, I don't have... I can't go through all this list and say what's wrong with everyone, but I, I, would, I would like to share a list of people that really need to be prayed for. And you may know uh, their needs. If you don't, then God does. But uh, Brandy, uh, Kelly, Mo, Mark, Frank, Patty, Don, Caroline, Jimmy, uh, Deborah's friend, Lori, Dennis, Lori, and Jim. And Heidi. And Heidi, yes, I didn't get her on the list, Heidi. But we have really a lot of people um, uh, connected with our church that uh, have been going through a lot of stuff lately. I mean, it's just pretty heavy duty on terms of uh, the number of people that are that are dealing with uh, physical conditions. They're just falling apart. <laughs> you are getting older. That's what you have when you have an older church. <laughs> yeah, but back. Yeah. Oh, yeah. yeah. He's back going strong. But uh, anyway, if you would join us in prayer for those remembering them. And uh, we have Colette and company uh, with us this morning to lead us in worship. Yeah. We're happy to have them. And uh, so we're going to have a great worship time, and then we'll have a time to study the Word. And uh, it's really great to just have each one of you here. The lady is going to open us in prayer, and uh, then uh, we'll get started. Father, we just thank you for this day, and we just give you honor and glory for who you are in this day, Father. Uh, we love you. We bless your name. We thank you, Father, for all that you do for us. Um, Father, oh, I just lift up this list of people in our midst who are sick, and I know, Father, you have the power to heal them, and I know you have the will to heal them, heal them. and we just ask you to do that, Father. Extend your hand and touch them and heal them through us in Jesus' name. Father, I just ask that as we hear the word today, that it will become alive to us. We know that it is um, alive and well and sharper than any two-edged sword. And we ask you, Father, to manifest that in our lives today. Um, that we would leave this place uh, changed and <coughs> more uh, determined to be what you want us to be in these days of difficult times. 
Father, I thank you for the praise and worship team. And we just ask you, Father, that you would inhabit the praises of your people, Father, today as they lead us into your very presence, Father. Again, Father, we love you. We honor you. We worship you. In Jesus' name. Amen. 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 Thank you, Lord. Thank you, guys.